We waste no time on this channel, so here are six iPad accessories that I actually like and use. Starting off strong, we have the Logitech Combo Touch keyboard case. Opening like a book, the simple to use case has a magnetic and removable keyboard that uses no power as it connects via the smart connector at the back. The kickstand is strong and sturdy and can hold the iPad at many angles, ranging from just over 90 degrees to just under 180. The keyboard is as easy to connect as it is to remove. It features a trackpad and has pretty stock standard backlit keys. Its modular design means that you can even attach it at the back for extra sturdiness. You can also lie it down completely flat if you have nowhere to store the keyboard, but just note that this does cover the camera. The top of the keyboard has a row of quick access keys, such as brightness control, volume, and spotlight finder. Working exactly like you would expect a laptop to work, the keyboard has a trackpad which lets you scroll side to side with two fingers and also other gestures such as four finger swipe up to go home. The typing experience is nothing special but definitely handy for work meetings, studies or recreational typing on the go. Besides typing, you might want a more comfortable handwriting or drawing experience, which is where this Apple Pencil Silicon case sleeve comes in handy. Yes, you literally just slip it on, aligning the logo with the cutout and it's ready to use. It just adds a little more drop protection and of course it still attaches magnetically. Have you ever looked at your iPad and said, wow, that's kind of revolting? Well then, you probably need the screen cleaner spray and wipe. The container works as the cloth, which perfectly fits a spray bottle inside. All you have to do is remove it and fill it with the cleaning solution of your choice, and you're good to go. Simply spray and wipe. It makes managing a clean screen so much easier. For gaming on the go, we have a USB Type-C to micro USB cable. I usually use this for a PS4 controller, but it also works with many piano MIDI keyboards, which lets you get the most out of your GarageBand sessions. It is plug and play for most games, but just note that Genshin Impact does require you to change the control type in the settings first. After that, your PS4 controller should work exactly how it would on a PS4. No more annoying touchscreen controls for gaming on the iPad. Next we have a vertical laptop, tablet and phone stand. Sometimes I come home and I just want to drop my iPad down somewhere. This vertical stand just means that I have a dedicated spot for it, which doesn't take up too much space. For those who travel, this TomTok bag is a perfect fit for your iPad. Both sizes, 11 inch and 12.9 inch, come with two pockets, one for the iPad and the other for accessories you might have. Often for me, it is a space to put my pen, wallet, and a marker. Both pockets have zips to close, and the back also features a carry strap, even though I mostly use the messenger bag style body strap. And there you have it, six iPad accessories that are actually useful. If you liked any of them, I've put a link below to my Amazon storefront. Consider buying it from the links to support me as I do earn a small commission from it at no extra cost to you. Hope you enjoyed this video and see you next time.